Good morning, Wob Nation. We're through two weeks of the NFL regular season, and while there have been zero positive COVID tests for some reason, some of y'all's teams seem to be on life support. Don't know why. Uh, better go get a second test and see if maybe you are the one that has COVID. So here we go. Without further ado, the week two award starting out with the Kentucky Gentleman. That goes to New John with a pathetic 105.38 points. And to be noted, Sorok, you weren't much better. Almost got this for two weeks in a row. The early times goes to Cruiser getting beaten by Joseph by 59.48 points. Again, Sorok, you almost got this again two weeks in a row. Um, I think you might have COVID, man. Go get a test. Mellow Corn, we have two. We have Cruiser again. Seems to be a consistent theme between Cruiser and Ciroc with these bad performances the first two weeks. Dallas D minus three points. Um, you know Atlanta is a good team, right? Just just throwing that out there, okay? So maybe don't start defense against Atlanta. And then Ciroc, Will Fuller for Buffalo D. Both of them have zero points. Very interesting. Both of them should have done better than that against Miami. Uh, maybe it was the uh, the Miami fans that came out. Uh, they've been stuck in lockdown for six months, but they seem to play pretty decent against Buffalo. All right, we have the Buffalo Trace, the, the closest win. No surprise here. Uh, ben over Jason, 2.54 points. Jason, you couldn't pull it out, man. All he needed was your kicker to get a field goal and shut Ben the fuck up. Yamakaze, um, I'm going with Kenny surviving despite Saquon Barkley out for the season. And Cam Akers also went out, man. I mean, craziness. You didn't have a running back and you still managed to eke out a win. I guess that means New John's team is really, really fucking awful. Uh, Blanton's, the highest scoring player, goes to Dylan. Aaron Jones, 49.6 points. No surprise there that uh, uh, two weeks in a row, I mean... Uh, just the Green Bay looking dominant, man. I mean, Kyle, you got to admit, this is a Super Bowl team, man. This is this is a Super Bowl winning team if I've ever seen one. And then finally, Pappy Van Winkle goes to Dylan, of course, 199.48 points. Congratulations, $25 goes to you, sir. Don't spend it all in one place. Um, maybe buy your girlfriend a ring and proposed her with that money, just saying. All right, next week, week three, toilet bowl. Uh, Brian versus Cruiser, didn't see this one coming as a toilet bowl, but uh, Brian, you gotta pull out a win here, dude. Uh, you're 0-2 despite having some good performances. Chips aren't falling your way this year like they usually do. The upset special, I'm going with myself over Joseph. Uh, you know, not a ton of upsets availability this week, but I, I think I can pull this one out as uh, one one versus a 2 and 0 And then game of the week, this is a twofer. We have both Kenny versus Ben and Kyle versus Bobby. Both Kenny and Kyle, your number one picks, are out. Uh, Kenny for the season, Kyle for a few weeks, it seems. Let's see if y'all can pull out a win against better teams. Um, good luck, guys. Looking forward to both of those, and I will see you all on the waiver wire.